place that's called heaven How beautiful heaven must be When most of us leave home, we usually call or send a letter to those who love the most. And I believe that if a loved one's going home to be with Jesus could write such a letter today, this is what it might say. I had a safe trip. The angels carried me safely to Father Abraham's bosom. Oh, the thrill I felt when I met the one that died for me. And no matter what you've heard, just no words to describe the glory that surrounds him. I'm satisfied here. Every need's been supplied. Just wait till you see my new home. I'm satisfied because there's no sin here. Well, there's no murders, no divorce, no abortions. Well, there's no need to even have locks on my doors. Perfect peace reigns here. I'm satisfied because there's no sickness. I've never felt better in my life because I got a new body. It's just like Jesus. And I wish you could hear the singing. While David, he played his harp and while a great crowd gathered by the river of life sang that new song, but they couldn't sing that song. They were all listening though. It's really wonderful here because there's no strangers. Everybody knows me by name. Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego showed me around. Seems like I've been here forever. The weather's great. The cool breeze blowing all the time. And you know, one of the nicest things, night or darkness never comes. It's light here all the time, for Jesus himself is the light of the city. Please remember I'm safe and I'm satisfied. I'm not sick anymore. In closing, the only thing that would make this wonderful place more complete is for my family and friends to join me here in heaven. Fair haven of restful 